What's going on guys, it's Rated here, welcome back to the channel, we now know all of the new DLC weapons are released in Call of Duty World War 2, I wish you guys the best of luck, I hope you get every weapon that you do want in Call of Duty World War 2, but I'm going to be teaching with you guys how you can actually unlock the Sten and also other DLC weapons in Call of Duty World War 2. Now just before we go ahead and begin with this video, I'd like to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, which is Banana Tick, which is a website which actually gives you guys free gift cards yes you heard it right i'm actually teaming up with them to give away a ton of steam codes here on the website not only steam codes but they actually give away cod points in call of duty world war 2 all you guys are gonna have to do is go ahead click the link down in the description below and on screen right now you guys are gonna be seeing a little bit of footage on where you can actually claim your free steam code so all you're gonna have to do is sign up to the website once you've gone ahead and done that, complete a few little tasks, and then you guys go over to the map, and you guys can actually collect a free code. So go ahead and do that as I've teamed up with them for you guys in this video. Hopefully this does help you out. And with that said, let's begin with the main topic of this video. So right now, as you can see, I'm in the headquarters. The quartermaster is very busy today and it's actually swapped out with a different person. It isn't the classic quartermaster girl that we usually see, but it's somebody different. And as you can see, a ton of people around me are opening up the new winter supply drops. This guy got extremely lucky and actually got two epic weapons in his winter supply drop that he did get for free he also bought a few supply drops as well but that's not what i'm going to in this video i'm going to be going over how you can get the sten for completely free so starting off right now as you can see if you go over to the mailbox you can actually collect yourself a free winter supply drop if you guys haven't done it already now there is certain dates which i will link down in the description below for you guys where you can actually go ahead and collect one because there is going to be multiple of them every single week and that's how you can actually go ahead and get yourself some free supply drops but as you can see you want to go over to the quartermaster go over to collections now bear in mind take a look at my armory credits in the top right hand corner of the screen i have 33,000 credits in my account right now this is just simply from playing the game i have not bought a single supply drop in this game or any cod points in this game so far it's all been from me just playing the game but as you guys can see, I actually have 33,000 credits. Now, you guys are probably thinking, to get the Sten, I wonder how many credits it's going to take. Believe it or not, it took 31,000 armory credits just to get one of the collections. Now, that's absolutely insane. I have no clue why the collection prices are so high this time around. Hopefully, they do lower them. Maybe when the next collection is released and they will lower these previous ones, which I do think would be quite a cool feature, but... Right now, as you guys can see on screen right now, I've gone ahead literally blown all my armory credits. I was getting quite worried when I went to the last few as I wasn't sure if I had enough armory credits. But I got left with 2,000 which does mean it took 31,000 armory credits just to get the Sten. Now after actually getting this, I then realised you can actually get it for free without spending any armory credits on it. So that's a huge bummer. I didn't realise I could actually get it for free without spending all of my armory credits. I would have probably went for the Goa 43 instead of the Sten if I had known this as the Sten is identical to the Type 100. Nothing has changed. You guys are going to be seeing a bit of gameplay at the end of this video of the Sten. And in my opinion, it literally is the same as the Type 100. It's a medium to long range weapon for a submachine gun and its accuracy is not too bad, but the iron sights are horrendous. So I definitely recommend you guys ranking that up as you can see there's a special order right now You're gonna have to actually go ahead and complete 50 games within 13 hours So if I was you go ahead and do a method of just leaving your console on overnight have something continually pressing a there are actually devices you can buy which actually continuously press a button if not you can actually plug it into your pc and then plug your keyboard into your console and that would allow you to actually program it to keep on pressing x or a on the controller so you don't get kicked for inactivity i definitely recommend you guys going ahead and trying that out because in my opinion i probably would have went for something like the trench knife or the ice pick through the collection because it's a bit more cheaper and I probably would have been able to afford two of those collections instead of just the one I'd recommend you guys getting the Sten from Howard instead of through the Quartermaster It's much more cheaper and doesn't require you to spend any money or even trying to get any armory credits from the game 
Now there are also some special challenges I'm going to put on screen right now on how you can actually get yourself some winter siege supply drops in the game which will probably increase your chances of getting these weapons as well. But like I did say at the beginning of this video you guys can actually get some COD points from that website I did provide down in the description below. Like I did say I definitely recommend you guys trying it out because I'm going to be using it throughout this weekend to get myself some supply drops so I can post a ton of gameplay here on the channel. I'm currently grinding for diamond camo on this submachine gun as personally I would love to post that gameplay here and also hope to get a heroic variant of this weapon as well. But if you guys didn't already know double XP on Caratan 24-7 is live right now. They actually have a core and a hardcore playlist. This map isn't too bad, it's the winter version, but in my opinion, it doesn't beat the regular maps in this game, especially considering there's so many corners and buildings that people sit in. It's just not the most fun map to play in this game anyway, especially if you are an aggressive player like me. Now, if you guys actually want to get even more supply drops for free, what you guys can actually go ahead and do is just go AFK in the headquarters mode. Considering that this new event's out, a ton of people are active in the headquarters right now. They're actually going around and commending a ton of people. If someone commends you, commend them back because you can actually level up your social score to get a free supply drop as well, which will then hopefully result in you unlocking one of these DLC weapons out of that as well. Now there are going to be some daily challenges which allow you to get these supply drops as well like I did previously say. These are going to be listed on screen or they have already been listed on screen. If not I will link them down in the description below so you can take a look at them yourself and decide on what ones you are going to focus on first. And if you guys do somehow get any of these weapons, any of these new weapons or even heroic versions of them, please please let me know on Twitter down in the comment section below or anything like that telling me what weapons you have unlocked or even what weapon you are trying to unlock in Call of Duty World War 2 as I will give you a shout out and I'll actually post a video here on the channel showcasing your weapons. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. Check out the previous video I did post. It was actually on the new update and it's pretty cool in my opinion. I definitely recommend you guys going ahead and checking it out. Drop a comment down below saying hashtag World War 2 DLC and I know you watched till this far in the video and I'll give you a shout out in the next one. So make sure you guys go ahead and do that. But that's all I've got for you guys in this video. Keep an eye out for another upload who knows it may be a triple upload today hopefully you guys enjoyed it hopefully you have a great day and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace